Hello everybody, I am Mom Shebrins. Welcome to my channel. For today, I will teach you how to do another style of crocheted earrings using soda tabs as base. Look what I'm wearing now. Come on, let's start! For this tutorial, I will teach you how to make this style of earring. I already made a sample so that I will just copy it in on the other tab. And I will also teach you how to put some beads as in the finishing so that it will look nice. And the materials that we will be needing um, are crochet thread, of course the soda tubs, crochet hook, I'm using a size 5, another crochet hook to insert uh, in the beads, this is size 0.8 mm, it's fine and then it's, it can uh, push or go through the whole of the size 6 um, glass beads. Uh, we need also a tapestry needle to clean the uh, earring or the tails later on. A pair of scissors. Did I forget something? Okay, we'll start. I already taught you in the other tutorial how we would um, put in the base or single crochet within the ring. Oh, I, before I forget. This is a regular tab. You will notice the sharp part in here. I removed in this uh, other tab. Because this would be like, it's easier to do single crochets without this sharp uh, part of the tab. Uh, I just use a file to really smoothen out the this this part. So first, let's do a slip knot. And in this part of the tub, we're in. This is 11, 12, 13. Join in the first single crochet using a slip stitch. Chain one, single crochet, then half double crochet in the next space, then do a double crochet in the next space. Chain two. Then five double crochet. One in each single crochet space. One. Four, five, chain two, double crochet in the same space. Then 
then four double crochet, one in each single crochet space. One more. Chain two. Double crochet in the next space. And then half double crochet. Single crochet and then slip stitch. To do round three, just um, do si slip stitch in each of this single crochet so that you could cross um, this uh, ring or loop. And reach this this part okay just do single crochets On, do a, uh, when you reach this part for the third round uh, do a single crochet on top of the single crochet space so single crochet and then half double crochet then do a double crochet and chain one now okay. oh sorry about that in this first uh, after the double crochet you will notice that there's uh, th this loop you remove your um, hook and then this use your other very fine um hook and get a bead straighten this and uh, pull and put the bead inside the loop okay insert again your regular hook and then double crochet in this chain 2 space make 3 double crochet the third double crochet okay. this is where you chain one and then get the bead again and insert it here in your uh, loop Chain one, 
and then double crochet in the same chain 2 space. Okay, this is this part until here and um, skip okay in this after the third double crochet put a bead again Then skip two, then do a double crochet. Two more double crochet, one in each double crochet space. Put a bead again. Double crochet. In this space. Two, three double crochet here. This is the second. Third. Okay. Actually, this is the tip of this um, earring. Chain one, put a bead again, Chain one and do three, double crochet in the same, chain two space. Put a bead. And skip. Do some double crochet. Do three. This is the third. And then put a bead again. Then skip these two double crochets and um, 
do a double crochet in the chain one space I will teach you another way of, before I finish up with the uh, beads, I will teach you another way of putting the beads just in case you don't have a very fine crochet hook. Okay. This is another way of putting the bead in this loop just in case you don't have a fine hook. Okay, just insert a piece of thread and then um, try to thread your tapestry needle and then get a bead and insert it, okay? This uh, will take longer, uh, but just in case you don't have anything to use, or if your bead has a very small hole, then you are supposed to, you could do this um, way of putting in the bead in the loop, okay? Almost done with the okay. We do three double crochet in the same space. Then put another put your last bead do a double crochet then a half double crochet the next space and then a single crochet and a slip stitch Actually, now this is the finished um, the other pair of the uh, earring and then uh, I just do a chain one and cut you just clean this by threading your tapestry needle and inserting it underneath the the stitches now, you put the hook just as you do that, just as you did in the other earring. Put it, um, sew it, do it as in a sewing motion, and be sure that this part right side up, and they will have opposite. They will be in opposite direction so that when you put the earrings on then this face or the right side would be facing um that would that would be the side that you will be uh, 
at least displaying or it could be seen. Okay. Hope you like this tutorial and I would um, try to do some more and um, using um, using the soda tubs as the base of the earring. Thank you for watching! I hope you enjoyed and learned something from the video. And please, if you are not yet a subscriber, be sure to subscribe and press the bell so that you will be notified of my upcoming videos. Always. Um, and also, please like and share my videos. And don't forget to smile and always be happy so that you will always be pretty!